Up in Colleen tonight, where authorities are investigating an officer involved shooting that happened overnight less than a mile away from the Colleen Police Department. The shooting happened near Glen Hill Court off Featherline Road. Our Madison Herbert captured this video last night. You can see a heavy police presence and first responder presence. She has more from the city's police chief following an update on the shooting in a press conference earlier this afternoon. The call came in just after nine. Someone saying a man was walking around with a weapon. The first officer observed the male walking in circles in the street with a backpack. The officer on scene noted signs of mental distress, so he waited for backup. The second officer arrived at 9.24 p.m. Together they approached the male and asked him to put the backpack down. That's when police say the suspect reached inside and grabbed a weapon. At that time, the male reached into the backpack, retrieved a weapon, and moved it in an upward and outward fashion. And that's when the officer fired. At the same time, the suspect shot himself. Almost simultaneously, as the officer was discharging his weapon, the male placed a weapon to the right side of his head, pulled the trigger, and shot himself in the head. A black semi-automatic pistol belonging to the suspect was recovered at the scene. The man died at the scene. His identity hasn't been released, but they do know he was a 25-year-old Asian Pacific Islander. The officer who fired his gun is on administrative leave, while an investigation is underway. Following our officer involved shooting protocols, our CID unit will conduct the criminal investigation, while KPD ID will conduct the internal affairs investigation. The story is still developing as it remains unclear as to which bullet is the one that killed him. The autopsy is expected to clear that information up. You can find any new developments to this case on our website. Reporting in Colleen, Madison Herber, KWTX News 10.